Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for all the latest news and updates. Hello, you have logged into One India News YouTube channel and this is Mariam. Of late, India's closest ally in the subcontinent, Bangladesh, is miffed over New Delhi's reaction towards the Rohingya crisis. Bangladesh is unhappy over India's reluctance to criticize Myanmar as lakhs of minority Rohingya Muslims have fled the country due to violence and persecution by the Burmese military. A few days ago, Bangladesh's High Commissioner in India, Sayyid Muazzam Ali, met Foreign Secretary S. Jay Shankar and conveyed Dhaka's concern regarding the Rohingya crisis. Dhaka wanted New Delhi to put pressure on Myanmar to do more to stop this violence against Rohingyas and reduce the refugee outflow which is severely affecting Bangladesh. Now India, in order to avoid alienating Myanmar, which is clearly inching closer to China, is staying away from interfering in the Rohingya crisis directly. In the last one month, more than 4 lakh Rohingyas have left Myanmar and have taken shelter in Bangladesh. Recently, the Indian government too has indicated its desire to deport nearly 40,000 Rohingya refugees settled in various parts of the country as they pose a serious security threat. Amid all these tricky diplomatic developments, New Delhi for sure wants to continue its bone army with Dhaka. And in order to keep Bangladesh in good humour, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has asked Minister of External Affairs Sushma Swaraj to use her long friendship with Bangladesh's Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina. Hasina and Swaraj have been good friends for long and the basis of their relationship lies in their mutual love for saris. Both Hasina and Sushma Swaraj always wear saris and they have an enviable collection of saris with them. As Sushma Swaraj and Sheikh Hasina met in New York, on the sidelines of the UN General Assembly on Monday, officially they did not discuss the vexed issue of Rohingyas. But Sushma Swaraj has showed all support to Bangladesh in its time of crisis. The Indian Foreign Minister is likely to visit Dhaka next month for bilateral talks too. On September 15, Sushma Swaraj had a telephonic conversation with the Bangladeshi Prime Minister after the Ministry of External Affairs announced Operation Insaniyat, a relief program meant to supply 7 million kilos of food and thousands of mosquito nets to Bangladesh for the refugees. Moreover, Sushma Swaraj and Sheikh Hasina took the same flight from Abu Dhabi to New York for the UN General Assembly and the two leaders had a brief conversation on the plane. After Swaraj and Hasina's meeting in New York, the Indian government maintained that it was a courtesy call and that the Rohingya crisis was not at all discussed. However, those in the Prime Minister's office say that there have been a lot of informal meetings and telephonic calls between Sushma Swaraj and Sheikh Hasina to keep the bond between India and Bangladesh intact as the Rohingya crisis continues to haunt the neighbouring nations. That's all for now. For more news and updates, please subscribe to One India News YouTube channel.